I want you to try something. Pick up a pen in each hand. Everything you do with one hand, you do with the other. Now, draw something simple, like a heart. Whatever you do with one hand, you do with the other. Start with some simple shapes. It will be tricky at first, but you'll get used to it. Symmetrical pictures. Let's try something a bit dafter. Self-portrait? Okay. Don't overthink it. Just go with the flow. See what happens. There's no wrong or right. If both hands move simultaneously, you get some great symmetrical images. Lockdown haircut. There you go. Symmetrical pictures. If you do this exercise for a couple of minutes every day, by the end of the week, you'll be really good at drawing with both hands. What shall I do today? Hmm, something from outside. I saw some lovely symmetrical leaves this morning with spiky bits on like this. There we go. Try this. Head. Shoulders, arms, hands, back up and then down for the body, down to the feet and back up to the middle. We should have a competition so you can draw the best symmetrical person. Now some simple shapes. Sometimes the simplest things are the hardest to draw, like a circle, very tricky. See if you recognize this. Any idea? Christmas tree. What about this? I'm just gonna go mad now with a pattern. Great exercise for the hands, for the brain. Loop the loop. To use the rest of the space, I'm just going to use my whole arms to make a symmetrical pattern. Here we go. Zigzags, getting wider, bigger, now smaller. Just have fun with it. See what happens. up the middle symmetrical patterns okay have a look around your house find some of your toys that are symmetrical like this panda and then see if you can draw them left hand and right hand use both hands it's easier to make symmetry. Face, two ears, eye patches, two eyes, and nose. Now round for the arms, the body, there you go, symmetrical panda. Okay, now have a look around your house, see what you can find that has symmetry. Also, if you have a garden or a backyard or are going on a walk today, take a camera with you, see what you can photograph that has symmetry. I saw this path this morning symmetrical. I noticed some of these tiny heart-shaped leaves. 
in pairs, symmetrical. This shape I drew on paper, symmetrical. A model I made with Jenga, symmetrical. This one mm, isn't symmetrical. A stained glass window. Can you see the symmetry? These flowers and the bars, nearly symmetrical. Oh, look, my shadow, symmetrical. This cake, symmetrical. Scary, but symmetrical. Some fruit and vegetables have symmetry too. Can you see which do and which don't? Uh, look at these dominoes. Which one does not belong? Two of them show symmetry. One of them doesn't. So this one, you can see it's symmetrical. And this one, symmetrical. But this one, uh, it's different on both sides, not symmetrical. This one actually is symmetrical two ways. I'm going to draw it left hand and right hand, remember? Let's see if I can draw it quite fiddly because it's so small. Dots, two, four, six, eight, one in the middle and one in the middle. That's five and five, making 10 dots. Symmetrical domino. Now here's quite a simple thing that has symmetry. I wonder if it's simple to draw. Let's have a go. Around, like an oval shape, called an ellipse. And the top of the tin, the inside of the tin, like that. There we go. So whether it's toys or just objects around the house or outside, find some symmetrical things collect them, take photographs of them, and try to draw them. You could also try making your own symmetrical model or collage using small things like pasta, bits of cereal, string, play-doh, beads, buttons. Have a go, see what happens. It's amazing what you find with symmetry once you start looking. This is your project for the week. Drawing, making, building, creating, spotting, finding, symmetrical patterns and objects. And also, don't forget to practice your left hand, right hand, symmetrical drawing technique. So have fun with your symmetry topic. And don't forget, any good photos, drawings, photos of models, Send them to us at Freestyle Maths on Facebook. See you later. Have fun.